Alright everyone, welcome back to more RER2 Remastered. And uh, now I made, I decided to bring another medical um, mixed herb, <coughs> excuse me. I took the acid rounds out, because I, I, the fact that we have a choice, that you get the choice of either creating those, or, make, or just having regular ammo means you have to pick and choose. So I don't want to use them. And we're collecting plenty of flame rounds at the moment. I don't want to go wasting them. But we'll see what happens. And there's a save point. That's never a good sign. Looks clear. Careful, Claire. Careful. Careful. <coughs> Excuse Here. me. Easy does it. Come on. Over there. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Don't yell. That's like the worst thing to do in this game. Really? No kidding. <laughs> do we use the machine? Looks like we attempt that. No. Oh, Damn cut it. scene. You need a key card. Yep. Seriously? Here, come out. You can I try and lift that? Right. Well, effort points for it for the attempt, I guess. You're sure this is the way? This is how my mom took me last time. Sherry? I've been looking everywhere for you, Sherry. What? Brave little girl, leave your house in the middle of this mess. On the ground, hands behind your head. Who the I'm hell? Serious. Jesus. On the ground, now. Wow. Jerry, tie your hands. Why are you doing Shut this? up. Tie her. So that is who I thought okay. that was. You tie her up now, or she dies. Who the hell is this bastard? That's what I would know. About. Child endangerment for starters. Oh, wow! You'll want to talk. Sherry. Come here. What are you gonna do to her? None of your fucking business. You hurt her, I swear to God, my brother is stars and I will fuck that! Oh! Sherry, get over here. <clears throat> What's your name? What's your fucking name? Claire! Sherry, you come with me now, or say goodbye to Claire. Okay, okay, I'll go! You better be taking me to my mom. Absolutely. Don't listen to him, he's full of shit. Oh, Stop. hey, Stop. hey! Her, please! Don't Easy! Tell me how to do my job. Stop. Easy! Let me go! Let me go! Obviously, nobody talks to manners. That? Yes, That's a matter of opinion. I'll get you, you fucker! <laughs> What's well, one piece of the puzzle confirmed? Stay safe, Sherry. If you haven't figured out what I'm referring to, I won't spoil it for you. Don't worry. Okay. Key card first. Then that asshole gets what's coming to him. Yep, agreed. <clears throat> Who the hell was that? Look like must be where that guy came from. From my imagination, he I thought he was looked like a police officer. Nice. Trolls. <coughs> See, elevator. Huh? What the hell? Oh, the kennels. Oh, ho, ho, ho. no. Raccoon monthly tune issue. Wait, is that the same? I think that's the same guy. <clears throat> Attention, all Raccoon City heroes. Who's the most feared yet mo yet respected man in town? The answer should be obvious to any resident of our fair city. That's right. It's Police Chief Brian Irons. 
Oh, Chief Irons. Okay. That's who that was. The man that scares the bejesus out of criminals everywhere and stern father that loves every last one of us sinful citizens. Chief Irons is known for his great charity work, including big contributions to the orphanage. Aha. Uh -huh. Support for abused women? Well, clearly didn't demonstrate that there. Art preservation? Hence the jewel. Animal conservation? Um... Okay, we'll take your word for it. Let us know if we've missed anything. Well, in your own time, you could admit it when you're ready. <laughs> Just when does our great hero sleep? Dunn doesn't have a choice there. When asked, The city is my extended family. I'm just doing what I do for my family. She finds said with a soft smile. <laughs> that bastard is the police chief? The hell? Exp Cheese office! Aha! Uh -huh. So that's how we get access to that. And we need a diamond key. And I think I know where that's going to be. Not that I'm looking forward to it. <laughs> now. That's for that way. Um... Now, last time to get the diamond key, we need to go through the moor. That means going through the kennel. But you know what? If we don't go th we have to go through there sooner or later. So let's just get the hell over with. Might as well. Equipment disposal notice. Oh, that's for the, oh, that's for the key. Okay, that's for the so. Uh, car to key key, <laughs> key to patrol car seven four three nine. Uh, bend key no longer usable, but can still open the car's doors and trunk with its keyless entry buttons. <clears throat> yeah, we know all about that. Excuse me. And this should be... Yes, it certainly is. No worries. Now, is there anything we can take in there? Ooh! Flame rounds. Hell yes. <clears throat> um, that's for... So... <clears throat> I won't read this because that... So, when I talked about an unlockable achievement, things I weren't wasting ammo for, there's a bunch of... The, there's little Mr. Raccoons, little bubble head things. They unlock, like I'd assume, they pull like some collectible um, achievement. That's basically all that they're for. I'm not going to read that because that's just... Yeah. I'm not... Like, I'm not actually going to bother with shooting those raccoons, so I'm not going to bother reading it. Nice. You let's stay there. So, see that thing in the back? That's that raccoon. That little, that little red thing there. That's actually the raccoon. I'm not going after it at all, so I'm not going to worry about it. Now that door there doesn't work because there is a generator panel on that side. So, yeah, not going to worry about that just yet. Not looking forward to the kennels, but what I am going to do first, <clears throat> and if I recall correctly, uh, this should be. Yep. <clears throat> what? So that's what that's for. Aha! <clears throat> okay, very nice. <coughs> See, a JBM HP3. Hang on, 13 sh 13 shot 9mm handgun, 
First to use double stack magazines, it was a marvel of firepower at the time due to how many rounds it could hold. Interesting. Laser sight. Oh, well, well, well. You know, that shit would make things a lot easier for targeting. That's actually got some ammo in it already. That's actually seriously good. Um, we don't need this anymore. That has 15 rounds in it. Um, <coughs> excuse me. What I might do. Uh, that, the thing is, I don't really want to waste the rounds if I can help it. Um, but. There is one thing. There is an attachment. I mean, 50 rounds is actually a lot for a gun like that, but to, to not have, but. <clears throat> High capacity. Now, that's what I was looking for. Combine. Oh, wow. Oh, it takes one slot. Yes! <coughs> oh, that's beautiful. Okay, 26, full complement. Excellent. Um, robust performance, but it it doesn't have a look like for me. The bonus is laser sight. <laughs> Do I? The thing is, when we're going to go, blah blah blah, blah can't talk now. <laughs> the bonus of doing all this is that. I'll have. Do I? Um, we can always use that, can't we, to get dispatch them? Um, you know what? Because you need to go through the morgue f first. <clears throat> All right. Because there's always stuff to collect in the morgue. Always. It's it's very, very unusual not to find stuff in the morgue to collect. <coughs> Excuse me. What I'm going to do is, though... I'll use up what ammo I have. Because that way, it's not... Because otherwise, I've just wasted the extra ammo I've put in that thing. So... Now, if it's the same in Leon's story... Which I kind of hope big to that extent it is... Then the diamond key should be in the mall. Oh, you've got to be shitting me right now. Liquors? Really? Actually, to be brutally honest, I kind of prefer liquors to um, <clears throat> the dogs. Which I know sounds a little strange to say, but... Um, got three am I gonna be needing more than three that's the thing um we'll see see how things go well it's taking care of the dogs so stay there just keep walking, keep walking, keep walking, keep walking. <clears throat> you don't bother them, they don't bother you. <laughs> it's the truth of it. Oh, I forgot we need that bit, don't we? <clears throat> oh, excuse me. <clears throat> oh, shit, we need the handle for the generator room anyway. Ooh, right. Okay, well that answers that question for us. You're going to go up at some bloody point, I'm sure. Autopsy record number 35477. <clears throat> uh, deceased Justin Hansen, uh, Caucasian male 39, um, found dead in a jail cell bed by staff. Hands are still clenched tight due to rigor mortis, which should be coming to an end, which should be coming to an end. It's highly likely that he died just after lights out. 
Deceased was a known kleptomaniac, incarcerated multiple times. Incredibly, he was still even when in jail, though that was consistent with his clinical diagnosis. <clears throat> Anything extra on these tables? Do the same. Yep, so there's nothing. Okay. Nothing there. <clears throat> One step at a time. something there yep sure that guy's gonna get up whoa it's these disgusting things in well they can stay in there as far as I'm concerned Should be able to get at that. Yes, we can. <clears throat> Lovely. That saves us one problem. Anything in here? No. Nope. Alright. One problem at a time. Um... Yeah, as I figured there would be. Oh, lovely. Headshot to the max. Yes, I was right. Diamond key. Perfect. And you have to go up, you bastard. Oh, that was a shocking. Oh, lovely. <clears throat> Anything next to this one? Don't think so. Double check. No, okay. We'll lay you to rest. That's fine. That's absolutely fine by me. Now, there's usually something next to this guy. <clears throat> I say usually. Put you back in there for you decide to pop out and uh, screaming. <clears throat> Excuse me. Now grenades are incredibly useful against liquors. I do know that much. Alright, now we've got the diamond key, we can do a few things. Which is good. Where's the asshole gone? Oh. Oh, okay then. It's alright, just keep walking, keep walking. We don't need to come back here for a while, it's fine. Don't look back. Oh, you got to be kidding me.
Was this? I can't remember whether there was stuff. Oh, hang on. Here we go. That should be... Ah, beautiful. Okay. Alright. Oh, Jesus. You ought to be shitting me. God's sake. Nothing else? Good. <laughs> I'm not in the mood. Actually... Uh, no, we can't fit anything else anyway, so it doesn't really make any difference. Um, what we're gonna, well, let's let's just go back and sort our inventory out. <clears throat> All right, let's go back and do that. Don't need the acid round, frankly. Excuse me, um... Combine that, lovely. Store it, so we don't need it at the moment. <coughs> um, usually only more than two things in the other room anyway. By that I mean the one in the fire range, there's that door we need diamond key for. Um, <clears throat> I'll do it one thing at a time. A little careful, because I know there's a liquor around. Oh, and I forgot to use the bloody... Never mind. At least we can get rid of it in that regard. That's good. <clears throat> we can completely use it up. So that's one really good thing about that, actually. Is that all there is? <coughs> Excuse me. Pardon me. If that's the third full locker, we've already got that. That was at, That's already done. So we don't need to worry about this anymore. Okay, that's perfect then. Oh, good. <clears throat> now I need to worry about where this lick is coming from. Don't look, just keep walking, keep walking, keep walking, keep walking, keep walking. <laughs> All right. Um, let's just look. Even if there is another, in, in, look. Even if there's an inventory box, a, a storage box in the chief's office, I don't know if there is. If there's not, just in case there isn't, <clears throat> I'm gonna switch around. I'm gonna switch out my guns as well. I completely, I completely forgot to do that, which is stupid of me actually. Don't need this anymore. Yep, take this happily. And handgun, lovely. There. Ammo. Good. I'm loving the laser sight. I really am loving that. Um, keep that just in case. <clears throat> oh. <laughs> uh, yeah. Let's just. Excuse me. Let's just save it just, just in case. All right. I know I could go and explore the other one. Um. Um. Oh, that's locked. Oh, okay. Well, that makes sense. Okay. Well, I don't have to think about that. That's perfect then. I like that a lot. And I do, I know there's at least two rooms in the mansion that we need the key for anyway. <clears throat> there's the linen room, there is the, um, 
Let's give one extra interrogation room. There's also, um, was that it? Oh no, I think there's a heart keys. <clears throat> oh, oh, I know what that's for. At least I think I know. Um, <coughs> oh, that'll help with aim accuracy, won't it? Costs two, but on the balance, that's actually not that bad, to be honest. Nice. I'll come back and get it. Wait. Thank you. Ah, so this is that private entryway. Okay. We can go down there, can't we? Yes, we can. <laughs> Just wanted to double check that. Just in case we've got a greed, they've got a, a red and blue herb already set up, so. <clears throat> so, there was a secret doorway. Oh my god. This looks like one of those, um, uh, things that you have in the, um, <coughs> what do you call it? Like you see in movies with the old, uh, sheriff's off, you know, the old sheriff office. Um, or stuff like that, you know, and the, or those really rich um, lawyers' office in the um, uh, down like in Texas and all that, where they have um, I'm saying from the movies and all that, where have all the stuffed animals and everything. That's what that reminds me of. Wow! Oh, lovely inventory box. <laughs> Perfect. Uh, put this away for now. Yes, I thought there was. Now, before we go and search all that out, I'll go and collect the other thing, the other, other part that was sitting down there. Because then we can just be progressive and getting everything completed. Makes more sense. Um. <clears throat> yes. This room. That all clear. Lovely. Except for generator room, but we look. We need. We need a crank handle for that anyway. <clears throat> And, <coughs> excuse me, there's a couple of rooms in the mansion, which, uh, in the mansion, God. <laughs> it's because, the other thing is, right, because of how big the mansion actually is, um, yeah, how big the police station is, I keep on comparing, I keep on thinking it's the mansion, <laughs> it's got so many half creepy rooms in it anyway. I thought that was a blue herb before. Oh, never mind. Never mind. Um. Oh, that's for that, isn't it? That mixed herb. Let's put you away. Nope. Because I've got to select this stupid thing, of course I did. <laughs> That should be combined. Lovely. Store. Nice. <clears throat> okay. I've gone and collect that green herb that was there. 
Double check if there's anything else we can collect. <coughs> nice. Um, I think it must be all one thing. Okay, that would actually make sense if that was the case. Double check. It's nice to know there's another way, you know, up and around. It's pretty sneaky of the chief to actually have one of those in his office, though, let's face it. Got that. Oh, there's another door there. Ah, okay. Right. Excuse me. Um, don't need that at the moment either. Put this away. We're definitely not going to need this, I don't think. <laughs> I seriously doubt it. <coughs> Excuse me. Um, I mean, I feel sorry for these animals, but everyone has their own hobbies. Copy of emails to Chief Irons. Please, Chief Irons, as thanks for your unwavering support, I have deposited a small sum into your account to use as you see fit. I hope I can count on you to maintain surveillance over your subordinates, especially the ones who survived that mansion. Get rid of them if you must. WB. And I'm pretty sure I already know who that is, but I'm not going to spoil that either. Police Chief Irons. I ran into some trouble with Umbrella Headquarters. That's the suits want to take the fruit of my, re of my research away. But don't worry. This will all blow, blow over soon. You just keep doing what I tell you, and everything will be all right. Same person. Chief Irons, you are, you are to up the security around my lab. Your muscle, your muscle heads are to shoot any suspicious person on sight. Doesn't matter if if they kill them, or even if they're umbrella employees. I'm so close to completing G, and no asshole is getting is going to get in my way. So that's a G virus, by the way. In case you, anyone's wondering. Well, it's pretty obvious in, in the lettering. Um, Irons. Get your shit. Get your shit together and do your fucking job. I told you I need more security in the sewers. Don't you know how critical of a time this is for me? As for the money, I can pay you whatever. I can pay you whatever. Once I take over. But not before. Why don't you get that? Now forget how expendable. Never forget how expendable you are. Hmm. That reminds us of some of the stories I heard about this game. Seems they were quite true to an extent. I'm gonna search just about everything in this room. Wow. Even a wait. I can I remember when that's a? Oh, actually, that's a turtle. I can tell. That's a. Is that? A Snapper turtle? Oh, I can't remember what that's called. I can't, it's something like it's a, it's one of those types of turtles. Snap it. That looks creep. That looks creep. Very creepy in how real that looks. Not kidding around. I mean, these animals look realish, but that painting is just creepy at how real that looks. Taxidermy log. White tailed deer, male, approximately six years old. Place to capture are clay mountains. Six one, three hundred fifty three hundred fifty pounds. Pleased with how it turned down, but I'm getting tired of working on these puny things. Maybe time to move on to more challenging animals. Siberian tiger, male, approximately four years old. Gaborski cry, Gaborski cry, uh, nine foot nine foot six. 529 pounds. Wow, that's a good catch. <clears throat> I nearly... I nearly came when I sliced its yellow belly open and its warm guts spilled out. A stiff smell of wild beast. This is life. Okay. I'm sorry? That's... That's... That... Description? Is disgusting. Sorry, that... Oh my god. <laughs> that's that's just no excuse for that. Pig. Female, 22 years old. Raccoon City, 5 foot 3, 
110 pounds. Specimen's body is soft, sweet, and white all over. It's mine. Forever. I've got a really horrible feeling that pig is a code name for a woman. I've got a really horrible feeling. God, he's getting seriously dark with his... What, creepy with what he's trying to do. So we've got a heart key, so it must mean the heart key is somewhere in that next room. Okay, wow. <laughs> Hang on, that doesn't have a hand to it. I hope that's intentional. Anyway. <laughs> After that, we're going to take a break and end this part here. Uh, next time, we will, looks like, uh, we'll be going back into the mansion, which makes a bit of sense. we got the diamond key. Uh, the heart key is going to be somewhere around these the ne this room and next room. Um, but we will be doing all that next time. And I'll see you then for more RER2 Remastered.